In doubles, a sense of partnership is key. But the longevity of Jean-Julien Roger and Horia Takao underlines a special bond as a team on and off court. This is year number four for, uh, for our team. It's amazing actually when I look back, which I do quite often, uh, how quick the time goes by, you know, and... Uh, Jules has got a lot of qualities that he's bringing to the team and he's bringing to the tour. We spend a lot of time together also and quite enjoy it. I've always said it, like, Horia is extremely professional and, and works hard and that kind of stuff makes it easy to get along with and try to achieve your goals, you know, so I can only speak for myself. I hope it's the same for him, but it's been a pleasant ride, you know, and uh, really enjoying it. Despite battling injuries at the end of last year, the pair came into 2017 with high hopes for the season ahead. Yeah, our year so far has been it's been okay. We started the year in Brisbane, did the whole Australian swing, and we lost in the third round of the Australian Open. So we we're hoping to do maybe a little bit better there. But uh, then, uh, quite uh, shortly thereafter, we won Dubai, which is uh, which is a nice title to have. Played semi-finals in Rotterdam. Yes. So that part was good, and then. Uh, Coming to uh, more of the clay court season, it hasn't gone uh, how we've wanted to so far, but uh, I mean, we're there uh, very positive and putting in the work. Beginning of the year has been uh, with some uh, good results and also some results that we didn't look for, but uh, we always work on uh, improving the team, improving our game, getting better. Every week it's a new challenge. We have the challenge of playing against some uh, very good singles players as well that are competing in the doubles and they make it tough. I think the standard today is higher in the doubles. Certainly, uh, like Horia mentioned, a lot more singles guys playing. We always welcome that. Challenges everybody to get better. We want those guys playing. Roger and Tekiao take care of the Brits. As an established team, there are different challenges. Maintaining a joint hunger to be the best is one of them. I think also the interesting things that nobody ever talks about, there's also challenges that come with teams staying for a longer time. Everybody always talks about all the positives. I guess also you fight when you're in your fourth year going on, you fight uh, maybe against complacency also a bit because we're quite comfortable with each other. Definitely feel more solid as a team. The communication on court, uh, we always worked on that, knowing what the other guy is going through, what he's thinking, and what we've been uh, working on and with the experiences we had with the few of the coaches that we worked with, we always look for, for improving the, the team. In 2015, Roger and Takao underlined all their talent and teamwork by winning the NITO ATP Finals. And their target this year is simply to repeat that success. London is always a goal. When we start the year, we always look at the ATP World Tour Finals and uh, see ourselves playing there. That's where we want to be in, uh, in November. But we got to take every week at a time, every practice week at a time, every tournament at a time, and uh, work on getting better and having uh, that mindset and having the right attitude and bringing the confidence into those tournaments. We can, uh, we can make it happen. Next week on ATP World Tour Uncovered, the grass court swing continues in Queens and Halle. And he's Bulgaria's very best. We catch up with the talented Grigor Dimitrov. Don't forget to log on to atpworldtour.com and chat with us on the ATP's official social network, MyATP, now on Vixlet, and on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. See you next week.